Hey guys, welcome back to a new vlog. We have an exciting vlog. I thought I'd vlog my week because there's some big changes happening. As you can tell from the title, we're moving. Me and my husband are just gonna rent out a place for a while. Um, just because we really need more space, to be honest. And I'm just so excited. I'm gonna bring you guys along with me. And right now, this is my life. I'm just sorting out my stuff. Obviously, you can see the boxes in the background. Even in my living room, there's so much stuff that's mine. It, it doesn't even feel like a living room here because there's just my stuff everywhere. It's not that anyone's complaining, but I just feel bad because like I feel like I'm taking up all the space. I'm going to be going to Ikea in a few days. A bit of shopping, eating out, so I'll vlog. I'll bring you guys with me and yeah, I hope you guys enjoy this vlog. Just ignore the state of me right now, but like I said, um, today is just sorting out, out my mess, all my products, what I'm gonna give away. I need to go for a haircut as well. Like, this hair looks so dead. Oh, uh, it's on my little sky Oh my god. I got sent this huge, huge advent calendar from the body shop. And I thought, you know what, I'll open it all now because it's a big box and. What is this hair? It's a it's a really big box and I thought, you know what, I'm gonna show everyone what you can get in it and then pack it all up. It's actually come in really handy with like all skincare, bath stuff. Honestly, this advent calendar is so worth it. You get so many stuff in here. Um, this is hair conditioner. I'll show you guys everything I've got in there in a bit. Vitamin C moisturizer, like literally such a bargain purifying glow mask shea shower cream shea butter moisturizer and a shampoo too i've got some bath blend a toner shower gel shampoo conditioner shower gel avocado body moisturizer and some more masks like honestly it's so 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 worth it and it comes in this huge box i'm just gonna put this away now look at all the recycling though i always get asked where i keep my makeup like the majority of my makeup she's so curious right now she's like what is going on what on earth is going on i keep my makeup in these drawers and i would say it's organized but mm, not really, but I need to sort out these lip drawers because I know for a fact there's a lot of expired stuff in here. Some of you may think that I have a massive makeup collection, and yes, I do, but I don't have... Compared to, like, other YouTubers out there, like, I don't have a massive one because I don't like to hoard. Like, I don't like to keep things that I don't need. So, as I go along, like, I always make sure I give, like, bags to my mum so she can give to friends and family. I'm always giving makeup to friends. Um, but right now, I'm just trying to see what I'm going to do for giveaway. This is uh, my giveaway bag for you guys. There's so much stuff in here. I've already started um, packing them back in uh, postal bags. This is to bring with me. There's a lot of the body shop stuff in here. This is stuff I want to keep. So yeah, I'm going to attack these drawers right now. Like, look at this lip drawer. I need to sort this out. Why is there a palette there? Okay, lip drawers are sorted. I really need to choose what Laura Mercier primers I want because... I really don't need all of these. I might keep the protecting one. I've sorted some here. I love my Huda Beauty Cream lipsticks. My Maybelline Lip the Glosses. These are literally dupes for the Fenty Gloss Bombs. So I've got them all here. But love. These are like my favourite glosses ever. Both of them. Sorted out my concealers and foundations. This is not permanent. I might get like storage from Ikea or something. Instead of these plastic things. But these do come in handy. I don't know. Because this is basically everything I used to film with. I'm just cleaning some of these drawers. Because honestly some of them are so grim. I have all my Huda Beauty palettes here. Like these are my ride or dies honestly. I always reach out for these when I go out or I have a special occasion. So they're definitely my fave like go-to eyeshadow palettes. And then these ones are also my fave. The, the Mario, the by Mario one. Like this one is like to die for. It's like, amazing for every day. And yeah, I'm just slowly getting there. I've got so many free drawers now. Free clean drawers. So I'm just going to quickly organize this stuff i also got these bits from laura mercier these are like their popular products this body moisturizer oh my god you guys need to go for it it smells amazing and it's so moisturizing always have stock of my tarte shape tape concealer lately i've been using medium tan sand but this one is my usual tan sand one favorite bronzer i'm gonna throw this one away because i've got a top up this one was definitely well loved <laughs> Oh, it's so silly. Damn, look at that. 
okay. So we're in our flat and we're opening opening our new Hoover. We decided to go for a shark. We got a shark. The with the cord and it's got anti hair wrap and it's good for if you have pets. It's working. We're in the Tesco home section and there's so much stuff here. We've got electric salt and pepper grinder and one of these things. And scissors, we're just getting essentials right now. I want to buy everything. I want to buy everything. I have, I've had my eye on the Smeg uh, kitchen appliances for a while and I never thought I would actually buy it. But do you know what I thought? Let me treat myself, okay? And we got the toaster and we also got the the kettle. Yeah, I, I really want the um, coffee machine as well. But I thought, let me wait till like maybe Black Friday for that. Oh. It definitely feels very fancy. These are definitely like Lux kitchen stuff, but it's so pretty. And it goes with the kitchen too. Here's a close up. There they are. They will look better in daylight, so I'll probably show you guys tomorrow, but I don't know. I thought here is better. It might change. Okay, we're, it's actually moving day and we've put our, um, we're just getting the boxes up. I'm just here guiding everyone, it's so bad. <laughs> um, I'm trying to like reset the heating. Honestly, adult, adulting is definitely another thing. Like you just have to think about everything, like heating, electricity, gas. So yeah, I'm just doing that right now because we're not going to sleep in the cold. It's definitely cold. We got our internet set up, so yeah. <laughs> Everything's running pretty smoothly. We're gonna head out to IKEA later, so I'm really excited. I'll bring you guys along with me. I'm with my sister, and we all got IKEA food. Can you believe this is my first time trying it? Everyone's digging in. We're looking for a sofa. I already know which one. I already know what sofa I want, but I'm just testing out other ones. But IKEA sofas are nice, you know. It's a cute little setup for work. Now we're looking at what dining table we want. It's a good dining table. There's so much at IKEA that. Can we come my mom? I'm up at Elafi I literally get so many stairs when I'm vlogging anyways. Um, there's so much stuff in IKEA that I literally don't know what to get. Ew, we're gonna take this. This looks good for olive oil. These glass reminds me of when you go to an auntie's place and they give you juice in this glass. You can really tell I'm stressed because of all these pimples on my face, but we spent the first night in our new place and <clears throat> Do you know, it just feels so nice. I was in so much pain after the move and I didn't even do much. Like, my husband did m more than me and he's, like, in pain. But, like, my hips, my back was killing me. But now I feel so much better. I got a good sleep. I'm going to make some breakfast. Ignore the state. I haven't washed my hair in, like, days. I just haven't had the time. I'm just going to tie my hair up. I just don't know what to do with it. All right, let's make some toast and some tea. Oh my god guys the lighting is so nice here. Ignore, I don't even know where my brush is. I honestly, I honestly don't know where I put my brush. I'm gonna use this to brush my hair. It's so oily. What are we gonna do? I think we're gonna go back to my mom's and we're gonna get the cats today. 
I also have like a few last things I need to get because I forgot my teeth retainer. I need to get the cat litter box. I don't know if I want to bring one cat at a time or bring both. One thing I love about this place is the big, big, big windows. I, I can't show you because I don't want to like... I just feel like with everything going on, like I think YouTubers or Instagrammers or like influencers, they should just be careful of what they share online because with the whole thing with Molly May, it just, the whole situation just sucks. Like... If you don't know, Molly May uh, was on Love Island, but she's like the, the YouTuber. I love Molly May so much. I'm like the biggest Molly May fan. She obviously has a bunch of nice things and she recently got robbed. And I think it was like 800k worth of stuff that got robbed. And I think like people kind of figured out where she lived. She shows everything in her home and that's kind of like what she does, like her vlogs and stuff. That's her job, right? And you should be able to be, you should be able to buy nice things without be, without being scared of like showing it and stuff but unfortunately we live in a life where we have to be scared and we have to be careful of what we show and there's just really dodgy people out there and that's just it and it shouldn't be like that but unfortunately it is like that um we shouldn't be putting the blame on money made like she should be able to buy her nice things and wear them but with obviously I don't know, I just feel like she might change and not want to show anything anymore because that's so scary, like, having someone rob all your stuff. Can you imagine? So, yeah, I'm not going to... I just want to be careful with the windows, but we have these big, big, big windows and, like, there's so much light that comes through. <coughs> with all the back and forth over the past few days, I've kind of got sick. And it, it's just really nice for me and my husband to have, like, our own space because we've been at home for a while and... We really outgrew the space, so we just got something that, you know, that's great for just the two of us for now. I don't know what to do with my hair. I think this is just going to have to do for now. This vlog's probably all over the place, but I hope you guys enjoyed this. I thought I'd bring you guys with me because I've always shared, like, my life and, like, throughout the years, I've always brought you guys along with me, like, through uni years and stuff, so. We're getting the cats over, and she's just looking out the window. I think she might vomit, though, because she's doing this... She might vomit. I got tissue. <laughs> Finally home, and oh my god, Sky did end up throwing up and drooling all over me. She's she literally has car sickness. Chi Chi's, mm, he's not having it. He's not having it to be honest. No, I feel like it will take some them some time to settle in. Sky will be okay, but Chi 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 is like a outdoor cat but i did read on google that it is possible that for them to adjust so we'll see hey guys uh i don't even know what day it is we've been just sorting our stuff out um and we decided to order wagamama do you know it's like a dream come true having wagamama on our delivery services like what i got the rasu curry the prawn one i always get that and i haven't had um i haven't had wagamama in so long since like pre-lockdown so i'm so excited for this meal we were supposed to go there but we have a cleaner coming in later we would it would have been too tight to go for lunch so we're having it now this literally looks so bomb what did hubby get i think he got like this beef ramen wow oh my god that looks amazing hey ton truc il a l'air trop bon t'es où j'ai mangé we watched army of thieves last night on netflix we didn't mind it, it was all right i just fell asleep i've been so tired lately mm -hmm. there's kimchi in there mm. i've been craving this mm. Nice and spicy. Oh, he's on my little sky. I don't know what that stuff is on the chair. I really need to fix this light in this room. Like, the lighting everywhere in the flat is really nice, but this one's a bit, it's a bit meh. We might actually go do a late Tesco run. But I got a lot done today. Like, I did a lot of the important stuff, like all the admin stuff that you have to do. I would love to go do my nails. Oh, look at all the spots on my face like every day there's a new one like i've clearly been so stressed the past few days weeks i think i'm gonna use some of this 
clarifying toner and serum so this has got witch hazel niacinamide bha oh uh, yeah i'm definitely gonna put this on because my skin is just breaking out everywhere are you supposed to use this press down on pump and apply with cotton pad i don't even know what we're gonna watch tonight oh this feels really nice feels really nice really like that so i'm gonna keep using this i'll let you guys know how i get on with it i've really been liking this murad nutrient charged water gel moisturizer and like obsessed with this uh deodorant like me and my husband wear this non-stop it's like a natural paste and like it just works so well guys i can't explain it doesn't like block my it doesn't block my armpit ducts as well like, and that, that can be kind of painful sometimes so yeah been loving this i've bought so many tubes of this kind of to the planet it's 100 percent recycle recyclable bioplastic tube made from sugar cane and this is super concentrated so you literally need like a pea-sized amount i'm gonna make some pasta in a bit so, so yeah mm -hmm. 